Yo, welcome to the video, guys. Uh, it is. I'm recording this on my birthday, but it's like not my birthday because I already made that video yesterday. Uh, yeah, whatever. I, I don't know why I just said that. I just wanted to like say that, I guess. But today, uh, this is more of like a personal thing, not about some random topic today. Um, I was talking to a friend, and he put he woke up and randomly saw fifty dollars was in his account, so he put it on a parlay and this parlay he put it on uh he put on on this app for five thousand dollars or at least it would have been five thousand dollars but it instead was three thousand five hundred three thousand two hundred and fifty because he got insurance on it but the bet was <laughs> let me just read this out to you okay the bet was luka Doncic gets a triple double Jokic gets a triple double Kyrie Irving gets more than 25.5 points. Giannis gets more than 27.5 points. And my Pookie Bear Shy Gilgis Alexander gets more than 28.5 points. That's not all actually. Jaden McDaniels needs more than 3.5 rebounds. And Joel Embiid needs more than 30.5 points. <laughs> now, something I want to talk about. If I wouldn't be making this video if he made the parlay, let's be honest, bro. Like he he didn't he didn't get the parlay right. But Let's let's talk about the parts where it went wrong. Luca needed to get a triple double. You seen how Luca and Kyrie were playing? There was that game where they both dropped like Kyrie dropped like forty eight, Luca dropped like thirty seven, bro. Like Luca, Luca was did his thing. He got his triple double, right? Jokic, at the time of recording, this isn't confirmed, but he needed like three rebounds. Yeah, come on, Jokic, Jokic got his part, got his. Right. Next, I want to talk about is Kyrie. Kyrie for the past like 15 weeks has been averaging like 26 points. Like easily he's been averaging 26. He even dropped like 40 something a little day ago. Today, you know, Kyrie felt like I feel like every time he has a bet or a parlay, he does a little worse. He just they just don't feel like doing it. And so he does his parlay and uh Kyrie drops 18 instead of 26. All right? Which is already cooked. Kyrie drops 18 the second this parlay is there and he's averaged 26 for the past week like f weeks this is rigged this is rigged right <laughs> then Giannis he's also bets on Giannis to get more than 27.5 points Giannis in the th at the start of the third quarter has 15 points Giannis gets injured and they say because he played already the first half we can't give you a did not play. We can't give you anything because he got injured. So blah, blah. You you lose the parlay because Giannis got injured. So because Giannis got injured, the parlay was completely cooked because it happened in the third quarter. What does that make sense? It was on pace to do it. But now you get nothing because he got injured. I'm supposed to lose because he got injured. Make that make sense. Like that just didn't make logical sense to me. But you know, whatever. Right. <laughs> then we go on to Shy Gilligas Alexander captain 31 points right uh he he's the greatest basketball player of all time i think you know what i mean shy does something that no other player has done and it's that aura it's that um i could talk about shy for days man shy shy something different you know when when it comes to basketball shy just does it smoother than anyone smoother than pg he does it better than everyone i think he's in the conversation like is it is it is it Michael Jordan? Is it LeBron? Is it Shy Gilligas Alexander? I mean, Shy is the peak of man. Shy is the peak of everything. Shy is the greatest to ever touch a basketball. You know, when LeBron was young, he said, "I want to grow up to be like Shy." When Shy was born, LeBron came to the hospital room and was like, "This is the one." He's like, "That guy has a print," because he <laughs> me eating. My fault. Apologies. Uh. <laughs> Jaden McDaniels need to drop 3.5 rebounds. Jaden McDaniels <sighs> plays for Minnesota, but, uh, so I don't like uh, it. Even though I live in Minnesota, it's just fuck Minnesota because my friends like Minnesota. Uh, Jaden McDaniels dropped 3.5. Don't want to hear it. Jaden McDaniels, I don't care. He dropped over. It doesn't matter. Joel Embiid drops his 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 puny over 30.5. He drops 37, <laughs> unlike Shy Gilligas Alexander. You know the greatest basketball player to ever done. a confectionery of a player you know just no oh, sorry almost hot back on that
but Joel Embiid drops 37. So his parlay for from $50, a seven pick parlay, that would have given him $3,250. Instead, he ended up, because he did get the insurance, he got $25, all because Kyrie, who averages 26, didn't want to make 26 and wanted to make 18, and because Giannis, who got injured, because Giannis got injured and cooked it. This reminds me of another friend who he he bet on what Russell Westbrook, who is my favorite player of all time. If you can't tell, I'm a Thunder fan, by the way. <laughs> he bet on Russell Westbrook getting over, Russell Westbrook getting over, what's it called? Eight points in a game. And Russell Westbrook dropped seven. You should have heard the rant he was on. Like, oh my fucking god, I hate him. He's so trash. This is triple double goat, this, that. Like, golly, bro. Chill. That's my goat you're talking about. You can't talk about him like that. But for real though, seven? Like, come on. That's almost as bad as this. Kyrie, 18? Seven to 18 don't compare, let's be honest. But Kyrie, you were supposed to do it. You were supposed to be the one to hold on. We just couldn't. You look like J Dub. Guess which J Dub I'm talking about? Oh, yeah. he, he just can't do it can't perform uh which is crazy to say by the way so i'm also a, like a Cavs fan because i was born in ohio so Cavs slash thunder fan and i'm talking shit about Kyrie right now but i'm not talking shit about him because of his play he's still a great ass player it's just because you know he dropped 18 why wow, freeze right there for a second but yeah that's all i really got to talk about here at least um I don't know why this video is like six minutes 45 seconds so far uh i'm gonna just yap about something until it's like seven minutes so uh i don't like luca's hairstyle i mean he is like just a white guy but like what does that what does that have to do you know i mean i don't like his hairstyle i don't like the way he look at niggas sometimes and you saw the video of him get water poured down his back he went oh, oh, oh. he looked back at it too like, or was that Jokic? I don't know. I think it was Jokic. Where he said something like Kurvala or some, some weird shit. I don't even know. But hey, that's the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. And peace.